Hi everyone, welcome from the steps of Lowe Library here on the campus of Columbia University as part of our conversation on career development and pathways in professions, we're joined by Liz Allen, the Acting Undersecretary of State for Public Diplomacy. The first question I have, Liz, is how did you get your start? I am someone who thought I wanted to be a social studies teacher, actually. I had really amazing high school social studies teachers. And com that, combined with the fact that my parents always really instilled a sense of civics and civic duty in us, led me to know that I wanted to be involved in something related to public service. When I had a bit of an epiphany in college and realized I didn't want to be a teacher, I knew I wanted to go to Washington. And so I actually really wanted to be a State Department intern when I was in college, and I went and did that. I went and worked on Afghan women's issues in Washington um, at the start of the Afghan war. and. And that led me on a path from being an intern to now sitting here with you today as an acting undersecretary, which is unbelievable. Can you talk a little bit about perhaps what you see as the role of institutions of education, both in terms of influencing your trajectory, but where you see a role for students now uh, as we talk about governance and international relations. And the first thing I'd say is for any student that is out there thinking about serving in government or in public service, as you said, it is a very lofty goal and ideal and calling, frankly. I mean, you were called to it. I've been called to it. It's not something that we need to do for our entire careers, but anybody who wants to spend a week, a month, a year, 10 years in public service, I would say, come join us. The question of finding your calling was important for you, but also maybe not planning too far yeah. ahead. What would you say about balancing planning and maybe taking risks? I love this question because I think that there's too much pressure these days on finding one calling in your life when in reality, and I think as actually you and I have both found, we're gonna have many callings in our life and that's okay. For me, I have felt like you know, the importance of public service laddering up to a mission or for people that I really cared about working with, whether it be President Obama and now President Biden, Secretary of State Blinken, I think a calling is just as much about the job you're doing as it is about the people you're doing it with. Well, tell us, uh, if you can, off the top of your head, what has been the most interesting place that you've visited throughout these years of travel? I think one of the trips that really stands out in my mind is um, I was able to visit Vietnam and Japan with President Obama in 2016. And it was my honor actually to shepherd the project to have President Obama and Anthony Bourdain sit around the table of noodles in Vietnam. I'm deeply, deeply grateful for the experience of that visit and to watch two great people talk about the fact that we're all a lot more similar than we are different, which is something I think we all need to keep in mind every day. We talked about the arc of your journey. Uh, we know it all started in Buffalo. <laughs> so can you tell us you're from Buffalo without saying you're from Buffalo? Ben, I'll keep it very simple. Go Bills. Nice. nice. Liz Allen, a joy. Thank you so much for taking some time, imparting some words of wisdom and some insights and some great stories. Cheers to you. Thanks for coming to Columbia. Thanks for having me, Ben. Good Absolutely. To be here.